Hey, class. It's been an interesting week in the markets. Uh, we've seen uh, value stocks begin to really outperform growth as the market gets more concerned about big tech regulation. Um, additionally, um, you know, uh, with the Republican Senate looking more and more certain, we saw uh, health insurance stocks, uh, names like CVS, uh, go up between 10 and 20 percent in very short order. Um, typically, boring banks like Citizens Financial, um, Goldman Sachs, Bank of America were up in the high teens to early 20 percent uh, range this week on the idea that uh, the COVID vaccine um, will solve a lot of the bank's problems. Um, alternatively, stocks like Zoom, uh, Peloton, uh, and, and the kind of uh, even even stocks like uh, Take Two Interactive, which reported a really good quarter, uh, were pretty beaten down the last few days. Um, so some of this is overdone. You know, I think even if we get a COVID vaccine, it's not like the kids are gonna or the adults are gonna put down video games and uh, start running and playing outside. So uh, some of this stuff might be overdone, and I think some of the um, kind of COVID stocks still might have room to grow here. You know, just because we have a vaccine, I don't know that if that means that everyone goes back to the office and starts getting an Egg McMuffin before work every morning again uh, and sitting in traffic. So um, I think there's still a lot to be sorted out here. Effectiveness looks to be pretty high. That was actually the surprise. You know, the surprise was not the vaccine being released. Uh, in fact, the drug companies had said it for some time that it was going to be before year end. Fauci had said before year end, and, and so did Trump. The surprise in the market was the efficacy of the vaccine, of the vaccine, which at around 90% is extremely effective. Um, you know that could wipe out COVID in, in short order, and by short order, you know, year and a half, um, with enough people taking the vaccine. Um, so you know, again, uh, just to bring up the value that outperformed growth, that phenomenon that's occurred, especially today. Um, is really a function of higher dividend stocks outperforming lower dividend stocks. Uh, energy also had a huge rally the last few days. Uh, energy stocks performed pretty strongly. Um, you know, that's another one that I think might be a head fake. I think just because we have a vaccine, I don't know if air travel returns. I don't know if uh, automobile traffic returns at the same pace as before. So the rally in some of these stocks, I think, might be unfounded and maybe a selling opportunity. Um, so, you know, that's all I have for today, guys. Feel free to give a comment or something below.